from Cobb County to the Hall of Fame. It's the boss man. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Cobb County, Georgia, weighing in at 350 pounds, the Big Boss Man! A man who possesses enormous size and strength and crazy agility. And from the awful verbal attacks to his ruthless physical assaults, in fact, one time, the Big Boss Man interrupted a funeral. That's actually funny. He represents the Cobb County Department of Corrections in the WWE Hall of Fame. Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. And his opponent from South Carolina, weighing in at 500 pounds, Big Show Stepper! I can't watch this entrance. I heard this one backstage talking up their own work nonstop. Well, why don't they get in the ring and prove it, huh? Uh, that's what they're doing right now, Corey. Well, good. Let's see what they've got then. A competitor who does not know the meaning of the word quit. He is ready for battle. This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. And across the ring is none other than the Big Boss Man, an old-school enforcer who holds nothing back on his mission to deliver his personal brand of justice. Yeah, when it comes to facing the Big Boss Man, nothing is easy. He's a gritty competitor who won't get shaken up by a few big hits. Once he gets his sights set on a target, he is absolutely unrelenting. He went right into that turnbuckle. Two count. This could be over sooner than we thought. One. I always love calling main event matches. Yeah, Corey, you get to see the heart of the WWE perform at main events. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. as boss man is that one seems to have caught him cold yeah but he's not breathing heavy yet oh man big elbow drop big boss man is known to have a short temper Corey, how does someone like big boss man with such lack of restraint come out the victor here well, for someone who's charged with enforcing the rules, Bossman doesn't mind bending them. If Big Bossman can keep his focus and bend the rules without breaking them, his opponent will be serving hard time. Gets the shoulder up too soon. Ooh DDT. Uh-oh. That holds back Bossman's attack. Oh, look at this. Headbutt. Setting up for something here. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. He was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. He was only thinking about dominance. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Spear! Spear! Lining the boss man up. This spells trouble for Boss Man. Something of a competitive edge has been brewing between these superstars lately. A drive to prove who really has the upper hand here. Their competition can really bring out the best in people, and I think we will be seeing that from them here and beyond. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Reigns down an elbow in retaliation. Oh. Thunder a shot to the oh. back. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. 
He's lost some of his win now. Yeah, the big boss man showed how cold-blooded he could be. Boss man slam, what impact. Wow. Boss man can't taste a win now. He is just barely still in the fight. I don't know how many more times he's going to be able to kick out after that. That was too close for comfort. That was the home run shot that got robbed at the fence. Ooh. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. <laughs> Punishing their opponent. Loving blow to the chest. Battling ringside, and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Or I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Grabbing their opponent by the skull and slamming him down. Oh, that's just disrespect right there. I kind of like it. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. Now the reversal by the boss man. Gets inside the ring. This match is brutality starting to show on him. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. And that one scouted. Here he goes for the win. Disappointing loss for this superstar. Yeah, really emotional. Very upset after what transpired in this match. And manager comes in to... Well, we know how much work this manager has put in towards guiding this superstar's career. So, oh, oh whoa, come whoa, on. Whoa. There's a lot of money left on the table. Understand. I think both these two just need to cool off. Emotions running high. Trouble in paradise. Manager lost his gravy train. Hey, maybe we're going to get a handshake. Yeah, I'm actually surprised if Superstar is extending his hand and... Well... Oh, wait! Things did not go as they planned. There is no reason. How disrespectful. But guys, you know, they should have known better than to take the bait. And one of these two superstars ended up looking like a fool, and we are just getting started. Tensions are high. Emotions running high in this highly anticipated match, but this is officially underway. It takes real toughness to climb into the ring after taking a few hits. It shows how much this match means to everyone involved. Well, I don't think that's a choice they should have had to have made in the first place. It's totally unfair. It could dramatically affect the final outcome of this contest. Only time will tell. Textbook scoop slam. Nicely done. Sleeper hold cinched it. And... Great side of the sleeper. Take him out at the knee. He's got him covered. And pops the shoulder up. Definitely looks in a hurry to finish things. Uh-oh. Denied with an elbow. Body 
SummerSlam slipped out. Inverted DDT connects. Gets out of there in a hurry. Back in the ring now. What a boot! Cover, cover! Big kick out! He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? Big forearm! Good golly, Miss Molly! He saw it coming, taking advantage! As their opponent hooked a couple of jabs, single underhook suplex. Nice. I can't believe it. Somehow able to find the leverage and get it done. Uh-oh. Thunderous powerbomb. Picture perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. Oh, look out. Oh, just completely off target there. He returns to the ring. Oh, what a forearm. Take your time and... Uh-oh. Dax gets countered. Close line. Well, oh, that'll leave a mark. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. He's getting pushed down into the defensive. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Caught in a bad position here. Don't do this. Don't do it! I felt the vibration of that one from all the way over here. And Bubba clearly ready for the fight here. Flagrant display of aggression to do something like that. Oh, and Stax fights back. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. He is looking to do some serious harm. Close line. What impact. What a counter! We've seen how this all started, and it seems to escalate with each week. The coals were lit, Saxton, and those flames have been stoked. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Ooh. What a hot shot! It's all the way to the outside. He's absorbing some tough hits now. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Hammer it away! Practically never-ending blows. Coming at full force here. Whip back into the ring. One press. Escape the attack. Oh! Punch lands. Planning on what to do next. Straight impact on the throat. Stack shows the way. Kick oh. connects with a body. And a big knee drop. Bubba is in big, big trouble. He manages to kick out. What strength. Unbelievable presence of mind. I thought he was unconscious. All of that work, all these big moves, and it still didn't earn the fall. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? He wants more. Speed up. Did Bubba Ray clinch this? Makes the cover. What? Only two? Somehow, some way, escape 
takes defeat. Still alive. That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. He's heading up top. Thinking big from the top. We are seeing the will to win from these men. Not an ounce of quit in them. The struggle to gain power has... There it is. Bubba Ray is your winner. Here is your winner. Bubba Ray Dudley! I know they must be feeling so smug picking up the win in this one. Yeah, it's real. I told you so. Energy, humility right out the window. To disrespect your competition and then definitively beat them like this, it sure stings a bit. But let's not rain on their parade. They earned it. Cora Jade is here. Jendo stick in hand, ready for a fight. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making her way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Cora Jade. Cora Jade has called herself the savior of the women's division. Look, Jade isn't here to play games and make friends. She's here to face the best of the best and take them down. She certainly doesn't suffer from a lack of confidence. Cora Jade is hoping to make a statement here tonight. And that statement is, you can't handle the generation of Jade. One of the top names in women's independent wrestling, Zoe Stark. Now looking to prove herself in WWE. And her opponents, first from Las Vegas, Nevada, the WWE Women's Champion, Zoe Stark. You know, Zoe Stark just oozes with confidence. She knows exactly how good she is. And that's because Zoe refuses to conform to anybody else's ideas of what she is supposed to be. She calls herself undeniable. Well, it's time to prove it. I have every bit of confidence that she will. Here comes a bad mood and attitude. No, here comes a true fighter with true self-worth. And from Shalom, New Jersey, Sonya Deville! Throughout her career, Sonya has shown her adaptability as a tag team competitor, a single star, and even a backstage official. You absolutely cannot trust Sonya, but you can depend on the fact that she will do anything to reach the top of WWE. She's a powerful striker with a very extensive mixed martial arts background. 
Yeah, Sonya Deville never pulls her punches, but does like to pull strings behind the scenes. Now, been a recipe for success for her at times, though. Here comes danger in a small package. Focused, determined, and dangerous. Yeah, and just looking for her moment to strike and shine in this division. Protector has arrived. I have to wonder, Cole, is Zaya truly a protector or are there evil intentions as well? Complete focus and determination. Zia Lee is ready for action. It's a fatal four away match. Four superstars, one fall to a finish. The number of competitors is four, but the volatility is off the charts. This is like pitting four wild animals against each other. The tension is absolutely palpable. We'll see if this is the start of a rally. Answering back. She's on unsteady legs in the corner. Needs to recover. Uh-oh. Rapid shots right to the gut. What a shot. Every strike more devastating than the last. Double flapjack. And when it's everybody for themselves, sometimes you just have to do what's needed to get the job done. There's common enemies everywhere. Taking it outside the ring now. A baseball bat? With a weapon like that in play, this is not going to be good. Paint a picture for me, Corey. Hypothetically, what are some tactics you'd use to win a no DQ match? Well, I'd stash some kendo sticks beforehand. Maybe the buddy waiting to give me a much needed hand. Maybe throw Saxton like a fastball special. That's the beauty of a no disqualification match. You can do all that and not get dinged. The sky is the limit. And now we see Stark. And into the count. Does the standing moonsault physically hurt? But it's got to bruise the ego, too. Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Kick the gut and start one tough, but that looked like it took a toll. There it is. Snap suplex. Placing them into the corner. Knee right 
to the back. She bails in a hurry. Uh-oh. Dragon Slaper. Oh. It's in. Rolls through, and she's free. As her opponent locked in, tied, and look at these vicious knee strikes. And a combination offense was on display there. Here's the cover. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. Tony DeVille rolls through into the triangle armbar. Got she breaks the hold. She'd like this deep into a fatal four-way match. It's a wonder they're not more banged up. But the grueling nature of this match is definitely getting to them now, gentlemen. Unpacks a well-placed punch. Oh, she responds with a counter. Right to the face. Jane is in big, big trouble. But now we see Stark. It is unbelievable what these athletes have been putting each other through. Absolutely pushing each other beyond any normal human's limits. Golly, that sounded rough. Inverted face lock. Driven down with an elbow to the hook. Sonya can be looking to end this. She's got it. Got her shoulders down. Makes a call. That could have been it right there. Savage knee to the face. Right to the spine. Zayek gets out of the way. And set right into the corner. And what a maneuver we just saw there. Oh, man. And she saw that coming from Zoe. Take it down to the mat. Oh, Kendo stick right to the head. Here's a snap mare. And a basement drop kick. This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. Johnny European uppercut. Oh, caught the clothesline to deny that maneuver. Taking it to the floor. What's she gonna do? She is just desperately trying to fight out of it. And now thrown back into the ring. The Irish whip, there's a reversal, and yet another reversal. And Sai is in some seriously choppy territory. It is scratching and clawing time if Zaya wants to stay in this. Ooh. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. And she's stunned in the corner. Kick to the gut creates separation. Oh, right to the spine. Here is your 
What an incredible conclusion to this fatal four-way. All these women were determined to win it all. This thing was really anyone's match. Here comes the money. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Palm Beach, Florida, weighing in at 260 pounds, the NXT UK Champion, the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase. The Million Dollar Man has been able to afford the best training money can buy. And DiBiase is a multiple-time tag team champion, a WrestleMania main eventer. I'd say it was money well spent. The winner's bonus tonight is pocket change to Ted DiBiase, but he still fights for every dollar he earns. Yeah, you can't underestimate the motivation of the million-dollar man. Like something straight out of a comic book, here comes Axiom. The masked hero of WWE has arrived. And his opponent from Madrid, Spain, weighing in at 154 pounds, Axiom! A calculated competitor Axiom finds the perfect angle to strike. There's no complicated math needed to figure out that Axiom is legit. I am actually really excited to see what Axiom has in store for us in this one. Yeah, hopefully we see some more superhuman feats from him tonight. Straight from the comics, Axiom looking to prove that it's mind over matter in this one. Michael, you have to love the message that Axiom spreads to the WWE Universe. He wants everyone to know that through intellect, you can overcome almost any obstacle. Yeah, Byron, it's hard to argue with Axiom's message when we've seen what he's already been able to accomplish. And that brings us to the Million Dollar Man. Don't let his reputation fool you. He is much more than just piles of money and good looks. When it comes right down to it, he can be a force inside the ring. I mean, just look at his build. Yeah, the best hand and training money can buy. He certainly does look the part, but I think you're jumping the gun, Corey, if you expect a million dollar man to put up a fair fight in this one. DiBiase was scouted there. <laughs> nice takedown. Sidekick finds the mark. Oof. Pain it right back with a reversal. Ah, DBS able to counter. Both superstars showing great. That's one of my all-time favorites. The Octopus Strike. Oh, what a 
Great reversal and counter by him. And count outs are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. And Axiom just got shaken up bad with that move. Yeah, old school efficiency shown here from the Million Dollar Man as he just wears his opponent down. Corey, we know that Axiom has a deep bag of aerial skills that can upset the biggest opponents. How does that impact this match tonight? While well, his agility is impressive, Cole, Axiom does have a few weaknesses. With his calculating mind, we've seen Axiom overthink during a match, and it's cost him. But what his opponent needs to concentrate on is grounding him. That takes away a much bigger portion of Axiom's offense. He's got him scouted. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. He could pin his opponent right here. Gets the shoulder up. Wow, what's it going to take? A truly impressive kick out this late. And Axiom got turned around there. Submission on the way. It's in. Figure four leg lock. Oh, look at this. He's trying to turn it. He does. Turns the pressure. Oh, man. Caught the leg. Oh, elbow to the knee. That'll hyperextend your leg. Oh, what a really great swinging neck breaker. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. Brought down with a DDT. Goes into the pin. There's two. Ted DiBiase has done it. Once again, the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase, shows that greed in any form is good. You should take notes, Saxton. Here comes the heart of Chase U. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing Chase University from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Thea Hale. One of the most impressive and maybe a bit overzealous students to come out of Chase University. But Thea Hale is dead set on proving that she is a grown woman who can get things done on her own.
Thea Hale is ready to step up to any challenge. Hale's set to change the minds of all the doubters and naysayers tonight. A Hall of Famer and one of the trailblazers in the women's division. And from Forest Lake, Minnesota, Molly Holly! An extremely sweet woman, but tough as nails in the ring. Perhaps the toughest woman in WWE history, and she's got the Hall of Fame ring to prove it. That's the bell, and as you can see, Thea Hale is ready to make a statement here tonight. Not the most experienced member of the roster, but she's getting better with each match, with every bit of adversity thrown her way. She's looking to be the next big thing here in WWE. The opportunity to prove herself is hers for the taking. Tonight could be that pivotal moment. Hopefully she doesn't underestimate Molly Holly, though, because that is possibly the worst thing she could do in this match. Yeah, Molly's as technically sound as they come in the women's division. And if you drop the ball against her for even a second, she's going to take advantage. Ooh, look at her answering back. Oh, man, inverted backbreaker. Ow. All measured up. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. A quick cover. the shoulder. Early one count, just to wear her down a bit. Close line! We know Molly Holly can hold her own in a tough matchup, but Corey, how can she make sure she comes out on top in this one? I think the key is going to be Molly leveraging her impressive technical know-how. She's a serious competitor who can tie you up in knots and find unique counters when she needs to. So the more technical she can make this match, the better. Oh, across the top rope. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. Oh, straight forearm. Oh, look at this. Hair pulled net slam. Got their opponent set up. Drop kick to the back. <laughs> Thrown back in under the ropes. Molly Holly trying to fire herself up. Nicely done. Chop block. Brilliant. Right to the back of the knee. Focus that attack at the base. Can't put together much offense with no base. Basement drop kick. Boom. Kick. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Playing possum. I love it. to squeeze that shoulder out so close. Oh, I had that well scouted. Shot on me. Cover. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Spirited attack from Thea Hale. She is never short on intensity and determination. Just look into the eyes of these. She can end it here. <laughs> Barely kicks out. If she keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. Ah, <laughs> oh, and Molly Holly answers back. She fucking. Rokita Clutch! Uh-oh, the end is near! No way she survives this! I think she's got... Oh, look at this, reverses the leverage. And she kicks out at two. You have to think this match is starting to take its turn. Ah, oh, boom! Elbow, 
puts an end to that. The Kimura, the Kimura. Uh, Kimura lock, submission move, will they? Hey, look at this, Kimura lock. Nowhere to go, but for him. oh my God, they broke out of it. Dominating shoulder tackle. Legs are trapped. And an inverted surfboard submission. Oh my goodness. Oh, and for some reason, she lets go of the hold. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. Uh-oh, this is not gonna be good. Oh, oh a leg breaker. She's going for it. Man, what an upset. An absolute upset. I am in disbelief. I still don't know if what we saw was oh. real. Superstar has completely lost it. There are only three things certain in life. Death, taxes, and Charlotte Flair. She is inevitable. An entrance fit for a queen. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from the Queen City, the Divas Champion, Charlotte Flair! Hey, if you want to create a legacy, in the WWE women's division, then Charlotte Flair is the mountain you have to climb. Yeah, there's no one even close to the amount of accomplishments that Charlotte has. The WWE ring is her unquestioned kingdom. <laughs> Charlotte will stomp you and then leave an imprint of her boot tattooed on your face. Highly skilled in every facet, strength, brawling ability, risk-taking, mind games. No other women's competitor has been so decorated, so revered. Charlotte Flair is ahead of her time. True greatness usually isn't realized until after you've been enshrined in the WWE Hall of Fame. Such is not the case with Charlotte. Just open your eyes and experience the greatness. Michael, she's the hero that the women's division needs. Oh, 
And when it comes to Charlotte, no one is more deserving of the hype that follows them. Plenty of superstars talk about being the very best, but Charlotte has always done that and backed it up in the ring. Without a shadow of a doubt, Flair's accomplishments speak for themselves, and Charlotte looks to remind everyone about them. But here's the deal. Mighty Molly might think she's a superhero, but you can't underestimate her in the ring. Lock it in, the Dragon Sleeper! Showing the world just how much fight she's got left! Solely focused on... Ooh. We know that taking out the legs is one of the most effective strategies in any match. Outside, what's the plan here? Oh, that got turned around on Molly. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. German suplex. She's starting to look concerned. Return fire from Molly. Ah, oh, normal right suplex. Cover! She kicks out at one. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Look at the arm for a Fujiwara arm bar. Ah, oh, Fujiwara arm bar applied. Hard to grab or apply a proper hold after a move like that. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Great strength being shown here. Ooh, pinpointing the trachea. Corey, do you have any insight on Charlotte Flair's mindset in this one? Charlotte wants more than a win. She wants to assert her dominance. People pretend they don't know just how superior Charlotte Flair is. So sometimes she needs to remind them. Dragon Sleeper applied. This could be it. Nice. Showing the world just how much fight she's got left. <laughs> Running Bulldog. <laughs> she flips it back on her. So much damage inflicted. A counter. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Oh, that got turned around on Molly. Oh, man. Great way to completely disrupt the momentum and buy yourself some time. Wow, that hurt. The legs are a base that you do not want to lose. Chopping down the tree at the base here. Taking this to the floor. Nice leg pick. Oh, the knee drop connects. Two, three, oh. break. Oh. Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. Five, six, oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Referee's count at seven. They need to get back into the ring. Series of elbows looking to create separation. She does so. Taking this one back to the ring now. They beat the count. Just barely. First a knife edge chop and now continuing the attack on the knee. Straight to the knee. Tendons and ligaments in the leg can be easily damaged by that. That was 
the brilliant mind of Charlotte on display working in. Will it be? There it is. Charlotte is your winner. Here is your winner, Charlotte Flair. This one's over, folks. Charlotte picks up the win. We all know Charlotte never had any doubt about how this would go down. That's the mindset you have to have when you're the queen. The animal has arrived. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C. Weighing in at 290 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Champion, the We can list this man's accolades all day long. WWE Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, a man who has main evented WrestleMania, and now Batista simply demands that the WWE Universe give him what he wants. success both in the ring and in Hollywood which is insane because for some reason the WWE Universe has never appreciated Batista quite enough well no question about it Batista will demand the respect of the WWE Universe right here tonight
Maybe the best big match wrestler of all time, Shawn Michaels. that Shawn Michaels has for this business is truly indescribable. Being in the ring is heaven on earth to him. Michaels loves this industry. He loves the competition. He loves the fans. And they love him back. He's given so much, done so much, and the fans thank him for it. is underway. Love him or hate him, Big Dave has always carried himself like a superstar. The cars, the clothes, this is a man who loves what he does and knows he does it well. This is the same man who once appeared on Raw and said, give me what I want. And everyone knew what he meant. What he wants tonight, presumably, is a win. We'll see if he can get it in this contest. But with a confidence that borders on arrogance, Shawn Michaels is no normal opponent. He's got swagger on another level because he just knows he is too good in the ring. Yeah, Michaels is as talented as any superstar could ever hope to be. And those talents are exactly... Well, no, it's roll up! An easy kick out there. Looks like it's going to take much more here. He gets out of the way. Back. Uh-oh. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Good defense. Out of the ring, what's his plan here? Oh, oh, oh. God. Whoa. HBK with great awareness. <laughs> Michaels with the awareness. Ooh. Cross body. <laughs> Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. Oh. Knew what was coming there. Six. Oh, HB Shizzle, not above some mind games, it appears. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. When you see Shawn Michaels compete, conventional wisdom says to get him on the ground. But, Corey, that's a risky proposition because HBK is quite adept at... An emphatic victory. Here is your winner, the Batista. The out of the ring count getting the best of them tonight. The winner looks a bit let down that this is the way the match ended. Perhaps they should have tried to break the count at the end there.
Here comes the personification of longevity and hard work, the 16-time world champion. Well, not just a 16-time world champion, a Hollywood phenomenon, and a man who embodies the meaning of superstar. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from West Millbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, the WWE Champion, the greatest of all time, John Cena! A superstar whose dominance has bordered on controversy has actually found himself as the target of scorn for some. Uh, the dominant shouldn't be controversial, Corey. If anything, he's underrated at this point. Cena's beaten a who's who of this business. Hall of Famers, living legends, Triple H, HBK, The Rock. The list goes on and on. And that bodes well for his chances here tonight. And here he comes. And his opponent from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 225 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Chris Eric O. Everyone in this match is competing at such a high level. I predict one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. You can't get rocked by Cena's incomparable power. Now, this superstar is going to want to stick and move to the best of his ability because if John gets his hands on you, your night's over. And as the bell rings, you can tell from the look in John Cena's eyes that he is ready to do work. Hustle, loyalty, and respect. That is the battle cry, Michael. And we all know that when it comes to the squared circle, there is no one with more hustle than John Cena. He certainly has that motto on his side here tonight. But then you look into the eyes of the challenger. And even though this isn't a title match, we can all see that this competitor is going to treat it like it is. It's that hunger, Saxton, that insatiable hunger for gold. If winning the title is the main course, then consider this match the appetizer. Oh, the elbow connects. Cena plans in motion. Up high. You gotta be kidding me. Took a leap of faith and connected perfectly. This could be just what they needed. Michinoku driver. The key to taking on a superstar of John Cena's stature is to really study him, to devise a bulletproof plan of attack. By watching Cena's old matches, you have the chance to learn all of his bad habits and figure out where and how you should strike for maximum impact. Basically turning all of Cena's entering experience against him. That's a smart strategy. Pulled in from belly to belly. Off into the pin. Oh, somehow. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Into the suplex. Constant pressure being put on by Cena. Cena is certainly getting that fierce look in his eyes. Oh, Cena got caught with the reversal. Spin kick to the midsect. Cena ducks underneath. Couple of shoulder tackles now. Cena, the powerhouse. Going to finish things up with a slam. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Elbow drop. 
the piercing. Uh oh. Turned that one around. Now he's looking for some momentum. Yeah, his instincts are taking over. He turns it around. Nice hip toss. Oh, no, it's roll up. Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? Loose cover leads to a strong kick out. Just like that, Cena gets intercepted. Did you see that? That attack put Cena's determination to the test. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He's lining him up. Watch out. High impact missile drop kick. Wow, springboard attack. Taking a chance one more time and landing with incredible impact. He saw that one coming. Cena turning things around. And returning to the ring. Going for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their belly. Being contorted. Doesn't look good. Will that trying to find a way out. Using his power to escape. Going up top. From the top, the leader of the C Nation. Classic John Cena. That's gotta be it. Two count, got it. No, just a two. I mean, you gotta think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Saw that coming. Put into the corner now. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Oh, saw it coming. Powerless position to be in right now. Ooh, dropped right on their face. Puts the boot to the midsection. That's a free fall. The end is looming now. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. He's got the answer for that one. Uh, setting him up in position here. On the second row. Tornado DDT. He can end it here. He's got him. Cena's still in it. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Oh, look at this, just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Cranking the head. Shoulder tackle. And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Put in a position now. Tossed around like a rag doll. Here's the cover for the win. No, he gets the shoulder up. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. Set it up. Suplex. This is what he feeds off of. Moments like this, this big match feel. Chop. Well executed suplex. And Cena is being run ragged in the late going. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Wrenched over into a boss. The crab locked in. Nice counter. Cena up the turnbuckles.
Cena. Oh, wait a second. And Cena is taking on a lot of offense now. Somebody's done their research on Cena, obviously executing a plan of attack based on Cena's past matches. Forks the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. And gets tossed back into the back. Cena's looking absolutely powerless. Here it comes. Special delivery. Attitude adjustment. Hit that just as hard as his opponent. Oh, he got him. What a win. Here is your winner, Chris Eric O. John Cena finds himself on the losing side of this match. Cena lost. <laughs> Mr. Never Give Up should have quit before the match even started. Anxiously waiting for his opponent in this match. Here he is, and here we go. So much bad blood between these two. They didn't want to wait, and neither do we. Let him go. Not wasting any time here. The official rang the bell. Now these two can do whatever they want to each other. After a shotgun attack during the entrance as this match has found its way inside the ring at last. Now we can really get things started. But should we really be going through with this match after what happened before the bell? Well, if you want to go stand in the way of these superstars, go for it. Before I'm sitting, it doesn't look like there's any stopping them. Michaels turns that around. Man. Sends him into the corner. These two trade encounters, an absolute master class. It's got to be hard to put together a game plan against someone like Shawn Michaels. Where do you start? Well, it's definitely not easy, Cole. The versatility of HBK is something to admire, but it's also what makes him such a threat. A lot of Michaels' power comes from the speed at which he executes his moves. Suppressing Michaels' speed will help you catch him off guard. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. Gotta hurt. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Things went from bad to worse. This game's about winning at any and all costs. This competitor knows exactly what they want to do. Perched on the top row. There it is. Superplex. That move on its own will knock the wind out. His shoulders are down. Just kicks out. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. Quick oh. strike to the lower body. Knee right to the gut. Look out! Suicide dive! That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. Enable the counter. Absolute hatred boiling over in this one. This continues to be personal, not just professional. You're right, Cole. Sure, either side would love to beat the other in competition, but this is more about beating them down physically and mentally. Any time, any place. Damn the consequences. HBK connects. 
Pure poetry in motion from all HBK. Let's see if the band might be playing us out soon. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Isolating the leg. Oh, man, targeting the leg. And he gets the better of HBK. Close line. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. He moves just in time. Follow up on the splash. them out. Into the pin attempt. Two pushes through after two. Somehow, some way. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Ow! Foot meet back. HBK in real danger here. And he's definitely suppressed the speed of Michaels with these attacks. Definitely caught HBK off guard. Look at this. Kneeling. Off the turnbuckle. From the top. Look out below. Just crashing down with high impact. And a carefully measured knee drop. HBK being pushed to the limit now. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. I would still be careful because Sweet Chip Music can strike at any moment. Twist of fate. Oh, strong impact. Uh oh. Saw it coming and burst into the arm drag. All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. still has some fight left. Close fist connects. Oh, he could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Impressive reversal from Michaels. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Directly to the gut. Michaels hit it. Sweet chin music. HBK got all of it. Shoulders down. Kicks out. How? How? Hoist it up. These men have been giving each other such a beating. And you can see the toll of that beating taking effect with every movement. Wow, what a drop kick. Oh, what do they have planned here? Look at this. Handstand. Oh, that was awesome. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Oh, and an elbow caught him and cleared him to the floor. Springboard! No buttons! Saw it coming! And he gets set back into the ring. He's reminding his competition that they'll only ever be second best. At the hole of the arm, a chop for good measure. Not done yet. What agility. Nice arm drag. Lives to fight another day. Top rope, here we go. And listen to this place. Flying my arm. It could be over here. This is it. Breaks the close count. Almost inhuman at this point. Michaels avoids the attack. Oh, 
look at this, raining right hands. Non-stop blows. And Michael's on target with some late game offense. I'm not sure how, but HBK might be about to pull this one off. The heartbreak kid, tearing up the band. Here we go. He fends off the... What's he got in store for HBK? Twist to fake. Will that keep... Here he goes for the win. Can he close it out? Cover. He... No way. No way. You can never count the heartbreak kid out, guys. Michaels refuses to concede. We're going to finish it off. Swing. No man does that better. Two! Guys, he put him away. That's a pretty big win. Here is your winner, Jeff Harvey! Soak it in. You earned this. What a display of toughness and stamina to pick up the win here tonight. A moment of pride here, beating the odds and coming out on top. I'm sure the whole WWE Universe is a little in shock right now.